Hi everyone. So I have a package here. I'm about to open it. It's from Sage Goddess. I've been going a little crazy on that website and I'm not even like feeling like, ooh, watch yourself. Like I am in my element. I'm in my glory. I'm living my best life. Um, I'm in a really good mood when I get stuff from them because I don't, hmm, how, when was this? A few nights ago, um, through Sage Goddess, I did the um, new moon ritual, and I know I um, invited uh, one of you to join me, and I don't know if you, like, watched it or not, and if not, like, it's totally cool, but Athena, her name is Athena, and this is her baby, Sage Goddess, which actually has, like, other... <laughs> She has humans. No, she is a real, like, real mom. But, like, it's her, like, it's her baby. I feel like saying that. Um, and wrong thing. I'm trying to show y'all something. Or just read you something anyways. Because we all know how that goes. But, um, she's working on so many things. If you see her hair, like, I'm, like, obsessed with it. I'm just obsessed with her. Like, I love her. I want to be here for Halloween. Call me crazy. But my mom and I, we did the whole, like, new moon ri ritual ceremony thing. And I said to my mom, like, what did you think? Because I didn't know what my mom thought. And she said, oh, she seems like she has such a sweet soul. So, I think she has an actual location, like, somewhere in L.A. or in the suburb of L.A. Um, it is, like, a retail shop and then some. There's this other place called Spellbound. Spellbound? Sky, Spellbound Sky, um, it's also out in Cali, and that is, um, probably in and around the suburbs of LA, I think my mom has to, um, go to, like, uh, out that way for business, and she said, oh, yes, I'm looking at my iPad right now, um, like, do you want to come, you should come, blah, 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 and I'm just like, I don't know, um, I've only been to Cali twice, and while I think I had fun when I was there, I also had so much anxiety because I'm like deathly like terrified there's going to be like an earthquake or like something horrendous. Um, and I know what we fear we create and like let's be positive with our thoughts. But um, anyways, my mom's like, oh, but if like your my friend, <laughs> it's like Athena's there and or um... The Sage Goddess place is there, and this other place, like, I can go explore new new shops and new places, and just, like, I don't know. It's a thing. Hopefully, I'm making sense, but what I wanted to talk about was, I did that really long video, right? It was, like, almost 40 minutes, probably, or 30. I don't know. It was a long, long video, <clears throat> and I got it confused because I kept on saying that it was the summer solstice uh, ritual box kit when in fact it wasn't it was things that I ordered for myself and for my mom for a part of her birthday present because I'm doing this whole thing um for my mom like like a theme I have a theme normally I don't have themes I'm just like here you go enjoy this but like for Mother's Day I had a theme and she loved it so I might do a video on her talking about like what I got her I think you may have seen that I'm not 100% sure I may have showed you beforehand, but I want you to be like, here you go, um, and tell her, have her tell y'all her thoughts. So, what I wanted to talk about was something that really impressed me, um, hopefully I can find it, and, um, it got me thinking about, like, when I pursue some of my dreams, in life, like, this is not a bad idea, so. I, maybe this is what, um. No, there was an email before this email, and I just loved it so much. So, in that really big video, right, um, I was like, oh, well, now that this isn't, um, the summer solstice ritual box, then it's something else, and 
Oh, my leg is killing me. My foot is on fire. I'm having problems with my back. All right, anyways, that's besides the point. Um, so, there were some pieces missing, and I didn't want to, oh, here, maybe, I don't know. I didn't want to be that annoying person, right, that's like, um, my order didn't come, or I didn't get everything, or blah, 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 blah. So, I kept double checking, because on Sage Goddess, you can buy sets where you get like two items, right? Like for me, my thing that I got came with a rollerball of perfume and, and the bath salts. And um, you could order that where you get the two items or you can order just a one of the two. And depending, obviously, if you, the less you buy, the less money you're spending. So I was like, okay, how I looked at my receipt and it said, like, blah, blah, you know, bath, ritual, thingy, whatever it was. And it had the dollar amount. So I'm like, well, let me double check. I go back. I'm on the app. I have their app on my phone. I'm looking. I look up what I got and I see that to get the thing, that I got my mom that has a total of like three to four, three to four items equals the total amount on my receipt. So I was just like, okay, so clearly everything that I ordered had not arrived and I wasn't sure if it was just going to be arriving late because it hadn't been put together yet or like whatever the case may be. So I reached out to the company saying, you know, I got this bath set. So far, only the bath salts have arrived. I was wondering if the rest of the set is coming at a different time. Thanks, Mallory. So then I love how, like, they write back to me. And, um, the first thing I, well, let's see if this is it. Anyways, I'll just read what this says. I feel like there's two things and we might be missing one of them. But we're just going to roll with it. Um, it says, hello, Mallory. Thank you for reaching out to us. I'm happy to hear you received your order. I'll be sure to have your missing item sent to you right away. I do apologize for this inconvenience. Is there anything else I can do to assist you? Please let me know. Namaste, Sarah. It says, our magical email is monitored Monday through Friday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Um, PTS. Please allow up to two business days to respond to your inquiry and then subscribe to the Sage Goddess newsletter. So I'm like, how great is that? Like this company has office hours and like there's a team and they work together and there's someone, I don't know if it's just Sarah, but there's at least someone, if not more than one person, monitoring the emails and like so it's just like such a happy like email, a lovely email, and I love like the namaste and that they're magical emails, like and how it was almost like and this might have I don't think there was something else which was um like a I got an email back rather quickly, but it was like an automated automated automatic um email um reply that like sometimes businesses um or people have set up where it's like you get a, like sometimes my dad does this, right? Like I send him an email and instantaneously I get a reply back. It's like, I'll be out of the office today from like two to four. If you need like something, call blah, blah, and speak to so-and-so. It's like one of those things. Anyway, I feel like I'm talking a lot and I'm not showing you like what is in this box. Now what's in this box could be these missing items. Um, and if, hold on. So I'm reaching for something. Huh. So remember this envelope? I still have it because I'm. And what I might do before my mom gets home is go upstairs, open the box with her other present in it, and put everything together, and just make it look nice. And her birthday is not till um, May thirtieth, but we're getting there. And um, just have that put away. And like I want to. There's just things I need to organize. So if what's in this box is the missing components, I can show you everything together. Or it might be stuff for the summer solstice um, set. And if it's not, then that means I still have that to wait on. And Or this could be something else that I ordered. I just remembered another thing I ordered. I know. You're probably thinking, you know, slow down there, Mallory. But, um... 
What I'm planning on doing is getting an envelope. I think we probably have one lying around. And I'm gonna write Sage Goddess on it. And I'm gonna write down like every so um and I'm gonna write down Sage Goddess like somewhere in the envelope so I know like it's a Sage Goddess envelope. And then I'm gonna go through all of my um like receipts through emails and write down like the totals of each <coughs> thing. My throat's been very irritated lately from allergies. Um and because I do have money that I was putting aside for a new phone, a new cell phone, which at some point I'm definitely going to be needing one. But I realized that this and like all this stuff is so more important than a cell phone. And it's really what my heart, soul, spirit, etc. needs right now. So when I like, I was like weighing, you know, and I'm like, no, this totally outweighs a new cell phone. Um... So that money that I've been saving to go towards a new cell phone is now going to go towards all this stuff that I purchased from Sage Goddess to pay my mom back. Because I feel like once I'm able to let that money go and give it back to her, even though it might not be the full amount that I need to pay her, I feel like by doing that, that action and that one step, I'm going to create room for the universe to bring me what else I need to um to get things done and accomplished i'm hoping what i'm saying is making sense anyways we're gonna open this up, box up and see what is in it because we don't know i mean if if this could be multiple things a it could be the summer solstice box b it could be um the rest of my mom's part of her birthday present which the other parts in that blue envelope see something else that I bought and one of those things is going to go towards her birthday present. I have a bunch of boxes um, on the floor here because I just opened stuff from Amazon. Um, I got candy. I got um, cat. I'm so excited. I got cat litter. I got... Um, odor eliminizing stuff to put in cat litter anyways like that's not exciting i'm just excited for this box okay one by one shall we we shall oh look at this i have another one of these and i keep it on my desk and it looks just like this i wish i was a little different each time this is just basically like a thank you for your order spiel um imagine if like i saved all these that'd be kind of nifty what do we have? Oh, this. I have one of these that I have on my desk. I love this. I might give this to my mom or I might pass it along to somebody else um, because I just love what it says, um, which is, I see your wings, your radiant beauty, how you move from the heart, walking with wisdom, blessing the world. Close your eyes and remember you are magic you are loved and you are one. So, pardon me, allergies. <laughs> Either my mom or a special someone in my life, hopefully it doesn't sound weird, I'm just gonna get this. And I think I'm leaning towards that. Um, I'm gonna put it aside with their other little gift. Um, here we have another one of these. I just love this, this is on my desk. Um, this has to do with classes and all about the month of May. I'll put that aside um, to go. I'm just going to put it aside. And I'm, I'm working on a package right now for someone. And you may know who you are and you may not. You may be wondering, is it me? Um, just so y'all can have, not everyone, but some of you can have some information. Um, I just, oh, I love this. Um, this is the Animal um, Medicine Crystal Grid. I have mine on my desk and I just ordered, it's coming Saturday, on um, crystals for it because you need citrine, opal, tiger's eye, um, clear quartz, and you need a certain amount of each. So if I have any leftovers and it's going to be enough to um, do this crystal grid, then I'll put it aside with this and add it to this like who knew? This, there's someone in my life and they're about to be gifted with a bunch of nifty things. And they have no idea. I mean, they might know. <laughs> um, putting it all aside, I just... So 
so um honestly i don't think they would want this i mean i keep i kept mine because i just love looking at it it's so pretty so this so far is looking like oh my god this is this is the summer solstice box um, we have another one of these. This looks like the thing that I have over here, which is the Elemental Blessings. Um, although this might be different. Oops, I dropped it. Because again, I'm like, if I have dupes, I know who I'm giving it to. Um, I'm going to just carefully open this. I don't want to rip the sticker. I love the sticker. The Sage Goddess sticker, I saved mine and put it in a, um, a notebook that I have from a friend of mine. Because this may or may not be different. Maybe the same thing, just different colored fonts. No, this is different. Different piece of paper. This is a Midsummer Night's Dream of a Solstice Celebration Gemstone set. Alrighty. So what I did last time, hopefully I have enough room on my phone for this, is, um, see my little notebook with poops on it from Cynthia? I just put it in here. I'm like decorating. Yes. Alrighty. Um, so what does this say? I welcome Tatiana's magic as they enter the enchanted realms, as I spin, dance, and move within me resist the beauty and wisdom of the hidden realms amen oh and so it is um you have titanium aura quartz um something i cannot pronounce an orchid orchids calcite i'm getting excited all right so this titanium aura quartz um bonded with the titanium aura this is a stone of manifestation and releasing fear can I get an amen? Um, titanium aura quartz increases strength, courage, and um, tenacity? Tenacity, tenacity, and releases energy blockages in the body and aura, because we know I have some right now. Um, this Kara Car and C A R E no C A R N E L I A N um, offers a mega sorry major <laughs> energy boost while instilling both courage and enthusiasm whenever needed. It puts you into overdrive, giving you the push you need to get things done. We all know I need that right now. And manifest your dreams. It's sacral chakra. Correspondence also activates your sexual passion and your creative force. This stone is the passion of fire, fire, your chi, which I'm constantly being told I need to rev that up by going for walks and moving, exercising, dancing around the house, yoga, you name it. I don't stir that up enough. And uh, that's why I'm always like lethargic and tired and like, ugh. it's nature's cup of coffee. This orchid calcite, this is the stone of manifesting the divine creation, helping you bring matter into being. Orchid calcite magnetizes the energy around the, your divine, excuse me, creative energy center and draws high vibration towards it and you. Um, the stones are with your specific intentions come with our drawn... Descriptive cards, sage goddess, da, 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 da. So, depending on what you got. Now, I went with purple. Can you guess why? No, I went with purple. Your choices is purple, pink, and green. And I talked about all this in this last longevity of a video. Since it's not, oops, since it's not anything to do with this, I'm putting this aside. Um, but I can't, I have other cute little things I want to share, but I'll just save that. Um, I'm putting that aside for right now. Or, ugh, bending forward is not fun for me. And these are my temporary tattoos. Can you guess which one caught my eye and why I got these? I'll give you two seconds. 
the sunflower. Part of me is like, thankfully these are smaller than I thought, but part of me is like, I wish they were bigger because I wanted to put this, like a big sunflower temporary tattoo on the top of my foot. Cause how cute would that be? But I'm glad it's tiny because now I can just put this by my ankle. That's one of my favorite spots to put it, like a temporary tattoo or a henna tattoo. I love henna tattoos or like on the inside of your wrist. Hey ho. Um, so, ooh. Oh my god, imagine this going like up your like ankle or up your foot on the side of your foot. Love this. There looks like some daisies. Um, this is like the Hawaiian type of a flower I'm obsessed with. It looks like there's three daisies. The rose, honestly, I'm not too keen on. Orchids, yeah, sunflower, you betcha. So, I don't know when, but I'm going to be buzzing out those temporary tattoos. What do we have here? Oh, yes, and thank you. We have more of this. I still have my little one over here. I started using I'm like, what if I use it all up? So I have another sample, which, you know what? I'm gonna be that person that's putting this aside because do I, that's what my heart says. Put it aside, you already have one. Sharing is caring. All right, let's go. Um, here is my wand, the beginning of my prayer wand. I believe that's what this is. It's a stick, um, you know, obviously found in nature. And it has this purple ribbon on it. Um, and woo, I can't wait for the summer solstice, like ceremony slash like rich, rich, I can't even talk. I'm so excited. Ritual, which is obviously on June 21st, in case you didn't know. Um... And I'll be utilizing all this then. Um, and I also, uh, no, I almost, sorry, was tempted to get a kit for my mom. But then I was like, does she really need one and want one? She probably like, that's more for you. So I love this like color green. Uh, what is this stuff? It's tissue paper. Oops. I'll just clean up my mess later. Um, we have something here. I just, uh, if you know me, I'm a giver and you know I love giving. And this is fun too, popping bubble wrap. So, I'm loving that this idea came to me of putting stuff aside for someone. So I love these little like, um, reusable like baggies or whatever you want to call them and I like how they're kind of like see-through and mesh um let's see what we have in here oh my god so excited like y'all have no idea papers on what we have I'll show you what we have and then I'll tell you what they are Ooh, tiny tiny little things this is where I think owning a hot glue gun comes in handy or some sort of um, adhesive, so there still might be uh, a trip to Michael's craft store. But look at these little tiny baby stones. I don't want to lose anything, so I'm going to put it back in here. But I do want to show you all. Um, this is what really caught my eye and like I almost had a heart attack when I saw this. Look at this. Look at this cluster. Whew. Okay. Um, and oh my gosh, you guys. Um, let's start with purple. Is this one purple? Wait, wait, there's two stones here. And I'm like, which one's which? One of them's fluorite, which I want to say this could be fluorite because it has a, like tints, a little tints of purple on it. Um, so fluorite properties. They're great, um, pazing stone, which reveals sole purpose and helps you align with your intentions, fluorite clears obstacles to your dream. Carry it with you. Place it in a medicine bag or pouch. Hold to the crown chakra during your spiritual work. Do you notice I become like a different human when I'm like talking about all this stuff and showing you what I have? Um, I've become alive. This beauty. Oh, maybe this is the orchid um, calcite because that's a pretty purple color. Um, so this is the calcite, which brings feelings of peace 
and well-being and it removes negative energy calcite raises vibrational energy more gently than quartz i just learned yesterday that quartz like is a really pure clear quartz crystals like vibrate at like such a high frequency and i'm like i'm just taking a crystal class now um it feels growth creativity and optimism about life um carry it with you place it in a medicine bag pouch hold to any chakra during your spiritual work i feel like this would be really good for the third eye or the throat i really need to open my throat chakra better to it sooner than later i don't want to be like really like old and bitter i want to be like no anything i need to say i got it out now um okay oh man I'm going to keep everything in the box that it came in and put it aside um, because I don't want to lose anything for when it comes time to utilize this. And then the stuff I'm putting aside for someone, um, I'll put it in one of my little empty cubby holes up top and then I'll find a way to make it look all cute and pretty. And when I see them, they shall be blessed with a gift from me. And why? Because I felt like it. That's always side note. It's been like a fallback. Is that a drawback? I don't know what I'm trying to say. It's like, I am a giver on so many levels, but my biggest way of giving is like with an actual gift. I'm like, oh, here, you're thirsty. I got you a water bottle. Ooh, you need a pen? Like, ooh, I saw this, you know, and I thought of you. Here you go. Um, you're freezing cold. Wear my coat because you forgot yours in the car. Like, I'm just that person. And when someone tells me about themselves, and I'm always seeing things that makes me, that reminds me of them or makes me think of them. I'm like, they need this, they have to have it, and they'd probably love to be an owner to, to whatever it is. And I don't ever, ever, ever expect anything in return other than a simple thank you or thanks for thinking of me or this is kind of you, you're such a sweet person. I don't expect the world in return, and I feel like I can come on strong and be early in friendships, relationships, um, etc. I'm a very giving person, and people are not used to that. And it's like, why is this person, me, showering someone with monetary stuff? It becomes a little bit like, whoa, and then they kind of want to run away. <laughs> or they may thank me, but over time i don't feel like i'm appreciative appreciated is what i'm trying to say um and so it's like you know what i'm not gonna give you anything anymore because you're not deserving of it because you really hurt my feelings and when that happens it's a very sad thing but i don't ever mean to make anyone uncomfortable i'm just being who i am and that is a giver but i'm learning to give in other ways than just monetary stuff so moving along back to what's in this box there's like a little stone thing in here I and mean, that's also in that rollerball perfume over there um this is tatiana hey tatiana what do you know um this perfume is crafted with love and tension and a dose of magic just for you as you anoint yourself Focus on your intention for the day and apply it down to your wrists. Um, for what you do, ankles for where you go, and the third eye for what you know. This won't get it in your eye, probably. Use this blend. Um, the use of this blend may result in expansion of your mind, physical gifts, innate beauty, um, empowering you to create the divine creature that you are. I might in my garbage can here have the box that the rollerball perfume came in and part of me is like why did I get rid of that? I love what it says on the back and I want to keep the packaging so if I can dig that out you know I'm going to do it. Um, I want to smell this. I'm not going to wear it because I already put that other stuff on but this is what the front looks like and here's the back and this says as I anoint myself I welcome Tatiana's magic as I enter the enchanted realms, I spin, I dance, I move 
Within me rises the beauty and wisdom of the hidden realms. Amen. Aho. And so it is. Oh, it's like, it looks like it would be a spritzer, but it's a rollerball. And I accidentally rolled it right under my nose. Ooh, pretty. I'm like obsessed. If you haven't noticed yet, I'm obsessed. Um, I'm going to keep it in this box. Put it aside. I mean, you probably wear it now on any other day, but. Oh, now I'm like, I gotta dig up the other thing out of my trash can. Um, I'm gonna be digging through my trash in a minute. Hmm. You guys, you guys, you guys. somewhere in there I just am as I'm adding trash to my trash I don't want to like be like Ugh, I can't find it I'm bearing it alive oh yes I'm sorry well I'm not sorry I was gonna say I'm sorry these videos are so long like they are what they are. If you enjoy this, you're still watching it. If you tuned out a while ago, oh well. Um, how do I open this? Like, the little strings are tied in a knot. It's a little green, little baggy waggy. Um, I'm going to take some of these things out and we're going to look at them together. Oh, I love that they do this. This is like a one of those little, like, little magical touches that like warms the cockles of my heart and that is putting like sage pieces of sage in here and I keep them in there because I want it to constantly like purify and cleanse whatever is housed in these little pack pouches <laughs> whether it's what originally came in them or not um because I do um recycle recycle okay oops we have this, which looks like, um, I don't think you can see it very well. Got a dark back here. Put on some more light. There we go. Um, I want to say this is like a calcite, but then again, I don't, I'm not 100% sure on that. Um, this is a orangey red stone which I recently learned a red stone, orange stones have a lot of like vibrational energy. And if you're feeling like tired, these are great. They're like nature's coffee. Um, and this, I don't, ooh, this is like a tourmaline little um, like thing. Look, it's so beautiful. It's like an oil slick spill. Honestly, I'm not 100% sure if stuff like this is natural or if it was like, you know, man-made in a factory somewhere, but they might actually, because something else I love is birth, birth moose, birth moose, that sounds funny to say, but it's like this, this rainbow thing, and it's like very unique, um, either way, like, you know me and rainbows, and if you don't, I love them, um, uh, I love on a very sunny day being back here and like all the rainbows, if you've been following me on Instagram, you see I'm playing with my rainbows, um, putting these aside for now, we have this, which I'm probably going to save because these will come in handy for something else. Throw it on the floor over there. I got a big old mess. You should see, but I'm not going to show you. Last product. I wonder why there's a lot of green involved. Something to investigate, but I, I'm serious about digging through my trash and finding the thing. For the other perfume. Oh, I forgot about this. You guys, this is a candle and I'm dying. Oh my god. It looks like it's a double ended candle, it looks like, or maybe it's not. Nope. Hold on. There's some glitter on here. And it's purple. 
if you watched, I don't know, some, anyways, when they did the full moon, new, not full moon, it was a new moon, the new moon in Taurus, um, a couple of nights ago, there was a candle that was lit for the ceremony, and I was like, I wish I had, I mean, I had a candle, but not that candle, but this is the Tatiana candle. Um, as I light this candle, I invoke the Fairy Queen and welcome Tatiana's magic as I enter the Enchanted Realms. Um, oh, oh, oh my gosh. Orbeon? I don't know. O-B-E-R-O-N. Waves his magic as I embrace my own and experience the power and enlighten enlightenment days. Sorry. <laughs> it's like okay anyways um and experience the power of lang oh geez anyways lengthening lengthening days warm nights dancing around the fire of my own evolution i spin i dance i move and as I do, within me rises the memories, beauties, and wisdom of the hidden realms. Amen, aho, and so it is. Sorry, like I am very uncomfortable right now, so it's hard for me to like think and focus. So we have a candle. So I'm gonna put this back in the box. Um, and we got little stuff. So, um, I think other craft supplies, like adhesives, are going to be needed because we will be decorating these wands. They're not, well, I say we, me, and whoever else bought this kit and is going to participate in the summer solstice ritual ceremony, um, we're going to be decorating our, our prayer wands. So beyond excited, like you wouldn't believe, um, keeping my little thing here, which all those things, like I want to put them in like pockets page protectors or laminate them and they can be on my desk we got our tatiana perfume um and my temporary tattoos i almost got more and i probably will they have like a whole section of temporary tattoos and like flashy tattoos um there's ones that look like different cuts of diamonds and i thought how fun would that be to like put on your fingers um but yeah so excited um <laughs> ooh, i'm <laughs> so Pain and discomfort right now is crazy town. Anyways, and my ice pack's no longer freezing cold. <laughs> I'm probably gonna go like in the living room and like stretch it out. But anyways, if you enjoyed this video, I hope you did. Um, and I'll talk to you all soon. It's another excuse me long video, but hopefully you enjoyed it.